Are you the plastic surgeon? I must be. I'm melting. Oh, my God, look at you. Oh, yes, disgusting, isn't it? Can you help me? Of course I can. Get on the couch. I mean, what would you like? It's my nose, Doctor. I want you to change it for me. Why? Is it full? No, ah, a little dope there. Doctor, I hate my nose. Why? It's gorgeous. It's too pert. I want it bigger. You want it bigger? Yes, and look at my lips. Oh, your lips are perfect. But they're too soft, too full. And what about these? Yeah, what about those? Oh, they're ridiculous, Doctor. You must be able to do something with them. Oh, I could, I could. Oh, Doctor, please, you must help me. It's all wrong. Yes, well, I can, but you must be mad to want to do this. Oh, Doctor, please, just do it. I'll pay anything. All right. If you insist, but I fail to understand your problem, Miss... Uh... Bennett. Mr. Bennett. <laughs> Hi there. Well, what we've got here is a patient suffering from a stomach disorder, and we're going to have a look, see, and find out what the trouble is. Now, thanks to micro-optics, we don't have to cut him up anymore, because I've got this, as you can see, micro-optic cable here, <laughs> with a diameter of 0.1 microns, which, as any fisherman will tell you, is a pretty, pretty thin cable. Now, I attach a camera to this cable, pass it through his mouth, down through the gullet, down into the stomach, where we can get the whole picture on video. Okay, <clears throat> now let's see what happens. You attach the camera. Can I have the camera, please, nurse? I'm white! I'm white! The train has arrived. You must, you must go now. And you? I... I shall stay. Oh, darling, I'm not sure I can bear it. You must try to bear it. You must try to be strong. Oh, yes, I must. You must go now. You must try to forget the pain. Oh. You can bear it. Oh. You must be strong. Yes, yes, I must. I can. Goodbye. Goodbye, darling. Be strong. That's it. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Come on, darling. <laughs>